G'day guys, welcome to my last DIY for 2016. Today we're going to be making glitter champagne bottles for your New Year's Eve party. So if you'd like to learn how to do it and brighten and sparkle up your party, then stick around and I'll show you how to do it. Supplies you will need for your glitter champagne or sparkling wine bottles. Here I've got some sparkling wine bottles, Mod Podge and a sponge brush and I'm using gold glitter on one and silver glitter on the other one. Firstly apply the Mod Podge to the bottle. Now I decided to do it in sections rather than just covering the whole lot in Mod Podge as I found the bottle to be quite heavy to hold so I just wanted to do section by section. Then begin sprinkling on your glitter. But before you do, make sure you've got some white paper down to collect the excess glitter so that you can pop it back into the container and reuse it. You go through a lot of glitter here and a lot just comes off, so it's worth saving it and reusing it later on. If you've seen some of my other DIYs, you'll know that I always try and collect the glitter and reuse it later on. I did the same in my DIY glitter mug, as well as my DIY wine glass and drinking bottle. If I hadn't have done that, then a lot of glitter would have gone to waste. So I definitely recommend make sure you have something there to collect it. And if it's not a piece of paper, then maybe a container of some sort. If there are any areas that there isn't enough glitter, then add some Mod Podge and then sprinkle on some more glitter to those specific areas. Don't worry about glittering the whole bottle again, just do the areas that need the little touch up. I'm not sure if I'm going to give these bottles away as gifts or use it as some room decor, add some sparkle to my New Year's Eve party. What you want to make sure you do so that you don't get glitter everywhere is apply a coat of Mod Podge once it's completely dry just to hold the, all the glitter in. Otherwise, whenever you touch that bottle, you're going to get glitter on your hands and on the table and everywhere. So definitely put a coat of Mod Podge on the top to keep the glitter on the bottle. Thanks guys for watching. I just want to say a really big thank you for supporting me this year. Um, as I've been doing DIYs really regularly. If you're not already subscribed, then please hit that red button. It'll just notify you when I upload a DIY, which I really try and do every Wednesday. But you might have noticed that I'm pregnant, so we'll see how we go in the new year with the arrival of a new baby. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye!